We are continue working on preparation of sanctions, just in case. Although uh, the intelligence information that we have uh, makes us to believe that as far as the negotiation continues, and as far as the military deployment of Russia is not being completed, because it's not yet being completed, the possibility of a massive attack against Ukraine is not the most uh, probable scenario. There are other ways of attacking, like the cyber attacks. Like the one that the Ukrainian government suffered on a certain number of their website. Recently, we have allocated 32 million euros to, the, to Ukraine in order to increase their logistic capacities. I know that this, this is not going to solve the problem. But keep in mind that since 2014, when the crisis started, Europe, the European Union, has been supporting Ukraine both financially and politically, and financially things can be measured. And the measure is 17 billion euros through our association agreement. 40,000 million euros is the amount of our support to Ukraine for different reasons and through different channels.